Hey, it's Buddy Lee. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I'll be doing a Realm of Legends speedrun with my 5 star rank 5 Hercules. I'm bringing Ihulk, which gives 3 extra feats of strength to start each fight, Hawkeye, who reduces the Infuriate cooldown by 40%, then Thor and Cap Infinity War, which extends buff duration by 20%. I'll be building my feats of strength by landing heavy attacks and intercepting. And then I'll activate and curate by dashing back after the first light or medium attack and intercept with SP1 to get the three precision buffs. Now that I have the precision buffs, I'll build to my SP2 and intercept with it in the same way using Infuriate to get the cruelty buffs. These SP2s from Hercules do massive damage and they also give you a nice stun where you can land two 5 hit combos melting down the defender really quick. So this was basically the cycle that we're going to be looking for in all of these fights. We intercept with the SP1 and when she's below a bar of power and has the infuriate, it's basically a guaranteed stand up intercept letting you keep attacking. Here's a nice little trick. When you're close to Cap Marvel and she throws her SP1, you can dex it and throw a light attack to get the right spacing followed by a heavy. This guy is super satisfying to play. And I think if this was a 6 star rank 3, he would actually shave quite a bit of time off of these fights. He probably would be able to finish after SP2 and landing the two 5 hit combos. In this juggernaut fight, I will try my best to prevent him from throwing his specials while maintaining Hercules' cycle. However, even though I'm holding block, he still decides to throw his SP1. He really isn't cooperating with his specials or this fight might have gone much faster. That's one potentially slower fight out of the way, but there are still two more coming with Scarlet Witch and Wolverine.
I actually didn't get credit for an intercept on this SP2, so I only get one cruelty, which will reduce my damage going forward. It doesn't slow me down too much though as I'm able to quickly get back to SP2 and that finishes the job pretty quickly. It's kinda nice that even if you don't play Hercules perfectly, he still maintains huge damage. Again, I gotta point out how satisfying Hercules is to play, and you get those huge yellow and red numbers that just destroys the opponent. I miscalculate the distance here looking to counter Vision's SP2 and I take my first hits of the run. And again I get a little greedy and take some more punishment. This Scarlet Witch fight can be a pain because Hercules lands so many critical hits, meaning that Scarlet Witch is going to keep putting debuffs on or power draining, so you have to just see how things go on this one. And right before I can throw my SP2, I get power drained. Terrible timing. Right. 
This time I'm able to get my SP2 off and I get my cruelty debuffs. Now the Wolverine fight, and I forgot to mention that the synergy with Hercules and Cap Infinity War helps with this fight. That synergy places an armor break debuff each time you do a feat of strength, and that will, with the despair mastery will reduce the regen from Wolverine, making this fight much faster. There's two fights left and we're about 11 minutes and 20 seconds in, which is a great pace for a 5 star rank 5. I get hit with Black Bolt's SP1, and that actually would have stunned me, but instead it removes one feat of strength, which is a great piece of utility for Hercules to be immune to stun. Now just the final fight left against Hulk. Five star rank 5 Hercules comes in at an impressive 13 minutes and 24 seconds. He's such a beast and even as a 5 star he's more powerful than many great 6 star rank 3 champions. Well that's it for this video, if you liked it make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you guys later.